Uh, as you see, this is the Geronoma. Okay, it's very different from the Geronoma in Japan. It's also very different from the Geronoma in China because this is a tropical Geronoma. Okay, and uh, I think uh, for the past 23 years, people keep on asking me, uh, how do you find Geronoma? Actually, the the forests of Malaysia are full of Geronoma. Everywhere you can you can see a, 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 a Geronoma. So my first uh, meeting with Geronoma is uh, I think in the mid 80s. Uh, at the time maybe 85, uh, 1985, late 84. So the times uh, uh, when I go to visit uh, the Muda Dam, uh, the the side area, okay. So that uh, people bring actually people uh, bring this uh, mushroom to me uh, because I'm engineer maybe hope that I can uh, tell them what is a what is the uses then after that I went into into the uh, the forest of Malaysia and I can see many many Geronoma even until today you go to the forest you can see the big one the small one okay uh, or high on the tree and, and, and below the ground so many type of Geronoma okay so but uh, uh, we select it then we started to do experiment Okay, so we, we, we check the efficacy. So we only take the six species which has the highest uh, uh, efficacy, then, then we become the genoma of DXN. So, why DXN make genoma as the major product? Okay, first thing first. Genonoma in uh, Chinese pharmacopoeia, in the in TCM, traditional Chinese man, is of the highest ranking. Okay, uh, the Genonoma, Cordyceps, they have the highest ranking. Next is the is a, is a, is a ginseng. So when I identify that this is Genonoma, of course I feel very excited. In Malaysia, we do not have ginseng, but we have Genonoma. So I, I, I think God is very fair to us. So this kind of excitement is there. So we think that, oh, this is a good plant. So if we can uh, properly uh, promote this uh, product and expand throughout the whole world, it can help uh, many people uh, uh, gain, gain back their health, this thing. And it's a good product. That's why we, we, we focus on it. Uh, and until today, we still focus on Gendonoma. Even though we become the largest Gendonoma company in the world, but we still focus on the Gendonoma because DXN is a real Gendonoma company. Always a Gendonoma company. So of course people are asking us why do we need uh, uh, Gedonoma. The reason is very simple. Uh, Gedonoma is a nutritional house. Gedonoma is packed with nutrition, with 400 types of nutrition uh, in, uh, in, uh, in, uh, in a Gedonoma. Nowadays, people are having health problems because their diet are not balanced. When their diet are not balanced, they, they, are, they are malnutrition actually. Okay? So with Gedonoma, we can balance back the, nu the, the nutrition. And also, Gedonoma have two very important uh, functions. One is detoxification. It can remove the toxin from the body. And due to the rich nu nutrient in Gedonoma, it can repair back the, the body. That is resulted in regeneration. And we, we say that all the health problem is only due to this, this, this problem. Either due to toxin or either due to out of balance of the, of the body. Uh, of the body, uh, for 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 example, if a person having AIDS, uh, it becomes the virus. A virus is something that we doesn't want. It's a kind of poisons. When people are having a heart problem because of the uh, imbalance, no, the system is not balanced up. I still remember in India, we have one uh, uh, surgical doctor, heart surgical. He had operated more than twenty thousand sur surgery of this uh, open heart surgery for the bypass everything. Eventually, he prescribed uh, 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 the uh, 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 this thing. He told me that the more he operate, the more the patient coming in, and those patient after operate, sometimes after six months, after after seven months, come back again with the same problem again. So that he become very fatigued, you know, become very tired. But with genonoma, he said easily half of the patient do not need to go through operation anymore because genonoma can 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 clear the, the, the blockage and the good thing is that those patients they take a lot of genonoma before operation after operation never come back they mean their body can maintain in a in a in a in a, in a good uh, situation that's why genonoma is very important to the modern life 
We're modern life are full of toxins, no? And our body are, uh, 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 because of the lack of nutrients, the, the, the many parts of the body do not function properly. And we gain an aroma, we detox the body, we balance back, so they become a perfect food for our day-to-day -day living. Yeah. Many people are asking me, uh, Dr. Lim, uh, what, what are the food supplements that you're taking every day? They expect me to talk about Gadonoma. I told them, my food supplement is the rice, is the bread. They said, there's a proper food. I said, no, there's no proper food. My proper food is Gadonoma, Spirina. I take Gadonoma, I take Spirina, my nutrients are enough. Then I can take any other bread, rice, whatever, fried chicken, whatever, no problem for me. So that is my food supplement. This is a food proper. That's why Gadonoma is not a management. This is a proper food because it is rich in nutrients. One, one day when I am uh, having a meeting in the southern part of Malaysia in Johor, so they, they, they will bring one man from Singapore. Johor and Singapore are just, just by. So they, they carry the man, you know. They carry the man, very sick man, uh, come to see me. So I asked him, what happened to you? He said, he, he is a very rich man. Eh? He went to China, then somehow we contact with some unknown virus. Unknown, unknown virus, no? So when we uh, come back to, to, to this uh, Singapore, he go through many doctors, many hospitals, but the situation uh, keep on uh, deteriorating. So they can see the virus in, uh, in uh, using electron microscope, but they cannot identify which virus is that. So they become body become more and more deteriorating until the kidney become started to spoil. So when the kidney spoil, you know that the face become dark, you know, then he is very sick, you know. Then he is asking me, uh, uh, Dr. Lim, uh, what type of virus uh, do I uh, contact it? So I told him, I said, look, for the past three months, you go to the best hospital, you go to the best lab, they, they cannot see what virus are you. You, you meet me only for three minutes. Uh, how can I know what, what virus are, uh, are this thing? He said, he say, Dr. Lim, I will die, you know, because doctor give me two more months to go. I say no, 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 no. I say, I say, hold it, hold it. Huh? Not, not so soon. I say we do not need to know what, what, what virus are you, are you, are you in. I say now, virus is very difficult to treat because it mutates in in twenty minutes, but our immune system can react faster than that, you know, in a few minutes. Okay, so I say you need to strengthen your immune system. Then there is a race. Who is run faster? If the, if the virus run faster than the immune system, sayonara, you die, this is a thing. But if your immune system run faster than the, the, the virus, you will survive. So he said, what should I do now? He said, go for mega dosage. Take a lot of RG, GL. Then he go back and take a lot of this, uh, this, uh, this, uh, this uh, uh, RG, GL. Then after that, uh, uh, he survived, no? And survived uh, 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 properly. Okay, until today, we do not know what virus is that. But it proved our theory that it proved our theory that our gadonoma treat the body, the body treat the disease. This is the best one of the best example that I've gone through. Now uh, there are many sick people they are worried to take gadonoma. Okay, because uh, as you know, sick people if they take too much drug they will die. So they mistaken gadonoma as drug. But I'm telling you, Gadonoma is not drug. Gadonoma is, is food, you know. So we always tell the sick people, even though you are sick, you still have to take bread, you still have to take rice, you still have to take food, okay? This is food, this is not medicine. So you can take. So many of them, they worry. Because when they take Gadonoma, they worry there's a lot of reaction and, 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 and everything. I told them, reaction is the language of the body. Reaction is the, is the message from inside the body. There's nothing to feel about reaction. And Gadonoma do not cause reaction. Reaction is not caused by Gadonoma. Reaction is caused by your immune system. And your dead and life depend on your immune system. If your immune system is strong, you will survive. If your immune system collapses, you will die. This thing. So, but when your immune system is strong, then it can communicate effectively. Of course, you have a lot of, re of, 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 of reaction. But I told them, you may suffer for one week or two weeks. Let your body talk to you. Okay, you take Gadonoma, cleanse the body, you build back the, this other thing. So there's nothing to feel. There's nothing to worry whether you are sick, whether you are healthy, this other thing. That's why, that's why many people say, who can take Gadonoma? So I told them, before a person come to this world, before a person say bye-bye to this world, all of them can take Gadonoma. 
That means uh, a pregnant woman. Okay, when the child still is uh, inside the body, the pregnant woman can take gadonoma. Even the people at the age of 80, 90, 100, they can also take gadonoma. So there's no age uh, restriction. So before operation, uh, after operation, so when a person is sick, when a person is healthy, all of them can take gadonoma. Can you, when you take rice, can it be any overdoses and, and rice? When you take bread, there, there is no overdoses in food, you know. So when you take more, then it becomes wasted. When you take a lot of rice, you become a little bit fat. But it will not kill you or this other thing. That's why there is no such thing as overdoses in, in, uh, in Gendonoma. We have many cases that some people take 30 LG, 30 GL. We have cases uh, uh, in, in uh, there, there are many doctors, you know. They give until 120 pairs of RGGL uh, to the patients. Uh, those, are, those are very serious, no? Those are, uh, are very critical. And they survive. Okay? So there's no overdoses uh, in, in, uh, in uh, Genonoma, just like there's no overdoses in milk, uh, in water, in the food you are taking. It's okay. Many people, they still have the wrong concept. They thought this medicine. Maybe I take three, three pieces a day, three capsules a day, then I become very strong, I become very good at this other thing. It's not like that. It's not like that, okay. Dosage, there are three categories of dosage. Normal dosage uh, for, for the normal cases, not serious cases. Dosage for serious cases, dosage for very serious cases, okay. Like normally for day-to-day, for day-to-day -day, day -day operation, maybe we need to three, three capsules, uh, three pair to six pair per day. That is enough. That's for, for, for this thing. Then uh, when a person uh, not feeling well, there, there, there are a lot of serious problems in the body, maybe they go for half mega doses, 15 RG and 15 GL. Half 15 RG, 15 GL. Then the rest uh, is very serious cases. They go for mega doses, 30 RG and 30 GL. So the dosage had nothing to do with disease. The dosage had everything to do with the condition of the body. So if the condition of the body is not too bad, it been okay, maybe three to six pairs a day. The, the condition of the body already become bad, it's 15 pairs a day. The condition is very bad, then you go for 30 pairs a day. So this is the, about dosage. It's not that, okay, diabetes, how many pairs, this, uh, this uh, hypertension, how many pairs, heart problem, how many pairs, it's not like that. This is not medicines. There are few spirina company uh, keep on attack our member. Okay, he said that our our genoma do not have uh, amino acid. Our genoma do not have omega three, omega six. Our genoma do not have this uh, this uh, what they call chlorophyll. Then I started to study uh, spirina very seriously. Okay, of this allegation. Okay, we are scientists, no. Even though we compete with spirina company, but we do not take spirina as our enemy. Okay, we are scientists, so we study. The more we study, the more we fall in love into spirina. Oh, it's, it's very good food, you know. It's, it's, it's as good as uh, uh, this uh, gadonoma. Okay, then I started to order the sample. We ordered the sample from America, from from what they call, from uh, Asia, like in uh, this uh, Thailand, in India. We even go to this uh, Africa, you know. They have Salt Lake, they, uh, they have this... Uh, this uh, uh, spirina, we have import in so many species in Malaysia. Then not all of them are, 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 are acclimatized to to Malaysia government. So we, we cultivate in the lab. After that, we put into the, the, the pond, you know, and many, many, they die. 90% they die. But there's still a few are survive, you know. So this must be good, good spirina. We accept it. We go to the lab again. We multiply again. We throw to the wall again. Hey, it's died again. So, but the mortality become less and less. Strange. Even today, it's fully acclimatized. So that in Malaysia, we inoculate in the, the spirina. After two weeks, we can harvest every day for six months. No problem. That's why now it becomes very important uh, 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 product in, in this thing. Uh, people asking me, why spirina? Okay, because spirulina and gadonoma, they are 100% complementary to each other. They do not repeat what they have. You see, spirulina do not have nucleic acid, but these uh, uh, gadonoma are full of nucleic acid. Nucleic acid is very important for the cell function and everything. Then, and uh, uh, these, uh, the polysaccharide of uh, gadonoma are of high polymer. 
the polysaccharide of granuloma are low, pro low polymer. So when these two combine together, we have the whole spectrum of polysaccharide now, from low polymer until the high polymer. So uh, uh, granuloma do not have, uh, have this, uh, what do you call, protein. This one full of amino protein. Uh, granuloma do not have omega. This is a full of omega. But uh, uh, this, uh, this uh, 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 spirulina, they may not have any nosins. They may not have so many type of uh, uh, product that uh, granuloma is, is coming in. That's why we say that granuloma and, uh, and spirulina, maybe granuloma is a king, then spirulina must be the queen. And when these two combine together, we have perfect food. That's why now we have so many beautiful testimony when these two are combined together. So what you need to do is that you just take the spirina as per the RGGL. Let's say you take 15 RG, 15 GL, so you can take 15 spirina or maybe double. Uh, same or even double. If something to do with the blood, something to do with this thing, then you double it. As simple as that. Take it as food, you know. Okay, so do not worry too much about the, the, the dosage. Yeah. that my proper food is Gendonoma and Spirina. Gendonoma and Spirina is not my food supplement. It's my main food. Why I say that? Because Gendonoma contains 400 over these uh, nutrient. Spirina contains 2 to 300 of nutrient. These two combined together is 6 to 700 of nutrient. It's more than enough. That's why everybody should take Gendonoma and Spirina as the main food. Not, not as a food supplement. So when you take spirulina, when you take gadonoma, then you will be very certain. Today, your nutrient is enough. Your, 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 your nutrient is enough. When I went to Germany, in, in Europe, they asked me one question. They say German, many of them, they are suffering from depression. I think depression is very serious in Europe. Then they are asking me, what is the main reason for depression in Europe and especially in Germany? So I tell the German that you are suffering uh, for malnutrition and they're laughing all oh, they came on laughing you know this is the thing they say dr Lim, uh, how can it be possible in german we take organic food we are very careful with our food how can we we become a malnutrition i told them there are two kind of malnutrition one is you do not have enough food to eat like in africa in pakistan of course then this that everybody can know this is malnutrition but if you are very selective in your food, you only eat certain kind of food, your food is not diversified, you also have malnutrition. Then they ask me, what is the proof? I told them the proof is very, very simple. You don't need to use gadonoma, you do not use, need to spirina to prove. You just go to the supermarket, buy five or six vegetables, chop them into pieces, boil into soup, you drink the soup. If your body is, is nutrition balanced, no news is good news. Nothing will happen to you. But if your body is malnutrition, when you drink the vegetable soup, your, your, your cell becomes very happy. When the cell is very happy, they send good they send signal. Unfortunately, our body cell can send only one signal. Pains. The whole body here pains, they pain a lot of reaction. And in Germany, can you imagine? More than 75% of people they have this reaction by taking uh, uh, this thing. So after that, I'm telling them, then you must take uh, gadonoma, you must take spirulina. Well, they are more potent than vegetable. They are more important than vegetable. That's why now in Europe, you can see many people, they started to take RGGL as their main food. They put the, the RGGL into the cereal, into the coffee, into the bread. Uh, they, they, they make it into bread. That is a good move in, 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 in Europe.